as we all know, uh, choices are a lot more hectic and a lot different when uh, when uh, you're in the game. <laughs> um, we now have uh, Griffin Riders from the uh, Undead. No, you were not from the human. From Wake Up Media. Uh, but Christians have web, so that's not a big problem. Also, with the uh, skeletal mages in the uh, in the necromancers, uh, why he would get such an expensive unit that is so easily countered is beyond me. Uh, we have the uh, trusty shade here, following the uh, human around. Here, when I first saw this uh, replay, I expected the human to go around on the other way, uh, which means that uh, if you're not prepared for it or know it. Uh, with the shade, uh, you would probably be standing here and then figure out, oh shit, he's coming the other way, and then you have to run through your fucking base, and you're wasting time, and you're losing, you know, buildings, and everything is going crap. But since he has this shade following him, he could have uh, uh, prepared for that. Shade also told him when the human was coming the other way, so uh, here we are, waiting. We have skeletons on Gru here, waiting. Legions. Uh, let me some coffee. He will come in for the attack. And since the human sees that he's just there waiting with uh, with the uh, uh, meat wagons, he decides to pull back. Uh, meat wagons. It's a little hard to see how much damage they do when they have the bloody skeletons, uh, since uh, the. Uh, you know, blocker uh, covers up uh, what you have, but they are considered to be one of the worst uh, siege. Uh, uh, but <laughs> any damage is good damage, and here we have double AOE coming in. Should have gotten some uh, some uh, um, healing scrolls. I mean, he has uh, encrypted out uh, in goblin. A merchant here, but uh, uh, in this game, uh, the Pink Lord uh, decides to run with very little items. None of his heroes have items at all here. Let's have a look at the human heroes. Yep, we have some items here, including uh, Teleport Scroll, which is the most important item of all. The Blood Mage is fully stacked with uh, Clarity Portion, Portion of Mana, etc. etc. So, um, Blood Mage is of course, uh, it's a matter of money. Uh, he's at 94 out of 100, so he's getting only 4 per cycle, 4 gold per cycle, and that's uh, money that could be spent on units. Here we run in with a bunch of skeletons, and we have a bunch of priests, and it's a really bad idea right here. Yep, thank you for that experience. Didn't do anything uh, except that, basically. Uh, and the army is here and waiting, getting everything sorted out, battle positions. Again, I have to say, running skeletons in against the race with the best in the spell is not a good idea unless you uh, silence them or in other ways uh, disable the dispelling because you're just feeding the experience. Yeah. Well, even orc with uh, disenchant can't take care of that. <coughs> and here we go in. We have unholy or unholy frenzy on the uh, pink lord throws off a howl. And here we have a uh, dual blast right down on necromancers. That was uh, not so good. You should have kept them back and just sent the skeletons forward because he now has what is it three? Okay, so he has even less necromancers, so he just wasted in his entire uh, necromancer force. That was a very bad choice. But he does have some serious uh, heroes, I mean, uh, Pimp Lord is, is always a good thing. We have a level 6 Pimp Lord. I would have t- taken Doom here, but uh, apparently the uh, Doom Knight, or whatever you call it, uh, is the spell bolt, so uh, that uh, I can understand why he did. Uh, level 3 cleave, after all that's 80% more guaranteed, no mana cost, no countering damage. And here goes the Archmage. Ooh. That was unfortunate. And here we have a uh, flame storm, flame, flame strike. 
uh, thing didn't go down on these uh, skeletons, but he is taking down another rifleman. The uh, human hero has only a rifleman and his hero. Uh, if he hadn't sent his shade in, he could have seen that and just thrown up some more skeletons and destroyed everything, but um, he lets his shade stand here. Look cool. Yeah. Uh, we have uh, severely damaged heroes on the undead side. The uh, Grim Lord is at uh, almost 300 hit points, and the uh, Death Knight has enough for one coil. Um, well, we have statues coming in, three of them. Um, doing good on gold, has 1k gold, and he is now getting back his. Uh, it's not getting back this far. Uh, what is he doing with this gold? Where is he going? Uh, how much happening? Yeah, he is getting some more beans. And human is getting another expansion. The uh, first human mine is out. Second human mine, that's the first expansion, is at uh, almost yeah, 1100. Uh, the and that is at 3000 because he got up later and there was a lot of uh, fucking around. And the uh, first one, or the base one, is going down right now. He has a uh, second expansion going up. And we're getting ready for another assault, pushing into the base. And human is just standing here, got silenced. Whoopsie! <laughs> <laughs> so no flame strike for the hero for quite some time. And let's see what level uh, in level three dark ranger. That's ten seconds of uh, silence on heroes. It's uh, five, ten, fifteen, and fifteen, thirty, forty-five. If I remember correctly, uh, I can check up on that. But uh, it is quite some time. Here we have a flame, a flame strike going off anyway, and a. Uh, he should have been ready with the uh, with the silence there because that's currently his only way of canceling Blizzard. Uh, and here the Archmage goes down again. He's Christ pack some healing potions on the bench. Possibly get a Paladin third, so you can use Holy Light both to heal your heroes and to get you know the killing blow on on the ended heroes because he could have killed the Pitlord earlier uh, when the Pitlord was down in you know barely uh, a little red, but he didn't. The game is about to be over because Human got totally. Uh, let's just say he got uh, physical attention where it's not. Uh, popular, yeah, unless you happen to swing that way, but, uh, but, uh, anyway, the game is over right here, the human is, uh, going to, uh, you know, he says something about, yeah, I'm not giving up, find all my farms, blah, 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 but, uh, it's done, it's just a matter of cleanup, there's a lot of skeletons that's just standing around doing nothing, uh, he's done that all game, actually. Um, either that or suiciding them for, uh, you know, experience for the human. Um, but you can see here that uh, even though a human does have the best, exp and the best dispel, uh, you can counter that with silence. Uh, could have, uh, you know, had a bit more luck with the silence and can catch all the priests. But if you are facing a... Uh, Necro Wagon or a uh, a uh, Dark Ranger in general. Try to spread your uh, your uh, casters around. Uh, I mean, I'm not talking single micro them out to spread the entire and the uh, the entire uh, screen. But uh, if you have a group, just uh, drag select like half of them and send them off. And then uh, once silence goes off on one group, you can use the other one to heal and I uh, dispel the silence on that. Uh, unfortunately, uh, out to cast either uh, abolish or dryads or or, or uh, spell steal uh, won't work on hero uh, skills, so um, you can't use that. Uh, you have to manually do it, which is a bitch, especially for metal, unless you feel like spending uh, 60 gold of half for a wisp. The boy left the game and I was Pim Pim Lord uh, is just uh, you know, cleaning up, having fun, saving the victory, you know. Uh, the 
years ago. I uh, am very honored and privileged to, to do a game on someone else than myself. And uh, I'm a Stimplord, uh, he is a very good player. He, uh, very, very good strategy. Uh, thanks for listening. Uh, leave your comments. Cheerio.